Welcome to this quick demo of Expression Universalizer. What does Expression Universalizer do? Do, does? It allows you to convert your After Effects project so it can be opened up in an After Effects version that is not running in the same language that yours is. That's it, basically. So, if you're a template author or a work, uh, you know, an artist that has to share your projects around the globe, then Expressualizer will come to your rescue and make it so that your projects just work everywhere. So let me just show you quickly how that works. So here is a uh, standard layer with an angle control, and I'm going to tie it with a pick whipped expression. So what does this do? It basically allows me to use this angle control to rotate it. Fantastic. So now I'm going to go ahead and save that. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to switch to After Effects running in Spanish here and then open the same project. And you will see that when the project is open, now we have an error. So when we open this error, you can see here that there's an error. Now it's basically the same ex expression, but because this version of After Effects is running in a different language, Spanish in this case, the expression no longer works. And you're like, what the hell? And so this is where Expression Universalizer will come to your rescue. So you have to go back into the same language that your expression was written in. So in this case, it was written in English. So we are in the version of After Effects that's running in English. You run Expression Universalizer. Literally, all you need to do is choose whether you want to process the selected comp or all the comps in the project. In this case, we'll select this, just do the selected comp. You hit Universalize Expressions. It says, okay, it's done. It did one expression. You can see here now that the expression has been slightly altered. So now we can go ahead and save this project, switch to the one in Spanish, and go ahead and load it again. Drum roll, please. No error. So now I can go ahead and open this, and you can see that I can, you know, adjust it, and no error. So that's what it means that it's universalized, that it can work now in any after effects that's running in any language the uh, other final third option now is that you can batch process a folder full of projects so if you're a template author and you have hundreds of templates that need to be universalized you can now do them all at once uh, you basically tell it where where the folder is and then it has uh, these cool features you can have it match the name of the project so for example you could have a, your projects have a prefix that say to be universalized and then it will open only those projects and then you can say I want the new project to have to replace so it'll replace this to be universalized with the word done and that way you'll know that they have been processed and done or you could just add a suffix or a prefix um, this is intended to be helpful when you have a ton of stuff to process and you don't have to take notes to keep track of it so that's it, Expression Universalizer. Hope you guys enjoy it, and see you next time.